this is a quick tutorial on the AF Masonry layout. It's a new layout that gives you responsive design pretty easily. Um, what we have here is I created a page using the um, a tablet first template in ADF faces and I set the end width and the start width properties of it to zero. So you basically just get the template with the header over here, which is what I wanted. And then I'm going to use the center area and into the center area I'm going to bring in the new masonry layout component. Okay. And the masonry layout is an area that basically gives you very easy access to um, a responsive design type of thing. And into it I'm going to bring in a few panel group layouts. So the way I do it is I just click on the masonry layout and then click on group layouts and I'm going to add four of those to my page. Okay, then I'm going to shift select those and I'm going to set their style, or actually their style class. And I'm going to use the AF masonry tile size property and there are different sizes here. I'm going to start with a 2x2 two two size. One more thing that, and this is a built-in uh, style that comes with the alter layout. There's one more style I'm going to use, which is what I call the tile style. This is actually a style I created and I put it in the skin file. Um, Alright, so now I'm just going to run our little page. And in our browser you can now see basically four boxes. Okay. Now the interesting thing is that if I resize the browser beyond a specific size where they don't fit in, one of them will jump down like that. Okay. So let's do a little game here and switch some of the sizes of the tiles. So back in JDeveloper, instead of doing 2x2, two two, let's actually do 2x1 for the first one. Okay. Second one is going to be, let's say, um, one by one. Oh, actually, no. Let's keep this one two by one as well. Third one is going to be one by one. And the fourth one is going to be three by one. If we save and we switch back to the browser and reload the page, you can see a different layout. Okay, and as we'll go um, and make our page a little smaller, like that, you'll see it moving around. So one jumped over there. Now it's over here. So basically, what the um, masonry layout does is it tries to fit things into the area that is provided. Now what I'm doing here is resizing the browser. The thing you want to think about is this is basically the difference between looking at your page in iPad for example. This is landscape mode, oh sorry, this is portrait mode versus landscape mode. So again, this is something new in the ADF 12.2.1. Enjoy it. Oh, I wanted to show you one more thing. The style class, all I did in the style class is basically just make sure that you'll actually be able to see the boxes by using gray uh, background with a black border. That's it.